have an update tonight on the residents and homeowners who are demanding to be heard on the state's decision to install metered parking along Revere Beach. The community is planning a protest this weekend to force the state agency that oversees the road to remove those meter kiosks. As the I-Team first reported, residents say the state made no effort to reach out to the community about its plan. WBZ Chief Investigator Cheryl Fiandaka has our story. Organizers are putting up flyers for a protest against metered parking on Revere Beach. It's not fair to the to Revere public. I mean, they've been through enough, and now they slid meters in. I think it's horrible. I think it was very underhanded. DCR made the decision to put in metered parking during the pandemic, when Revere was struggling with one of the highest infection rates in the state. I had no idea they were doing it until I saw the meters. I don't like it. No one seems to like the idea, especially homeowners. I pay over $9,000 a year in taxes, and I'm not even going to be able to park in front of my house. And what happens when I have people over the house, guests? Do I have to run out and feed the meter for them? There are more than 50,000 residents in Revere, many of whom have English as a second language, and some don't have internet access. DCR notified 2,000 constituents and local media about the parking meter proposal. Thank you for joining us tonight. And held two virtual meetings, both in English with no translation. 115 people logged on. Meters will be installed on both sides of the boulevard. In a statement, DCR tells us following a robust public outreach effort, Revere Beach Boulevard was chosen for its accessibility by public transit and length of the beach. Residents now say they will will take to the streets Saturday morning in protest, demanding the meter kiosks be removed. I am going to go. I could understand if there were no houses along the beach. Like me, a lot of these people would like to park in front of the house. And you can't do it now without paying a dollar and a quarter an hour. I think the governor should, uh, he's the one that helped put him in. He should get him out of here. It's not fair to the people. We've been to enough here. Revere doesn't get any of the money from the meters. All of that goes to DCR. And there's no resident parking program here on Revere Beach. As for the dumpsters we told you about yesterday, after our story aired, DCR tells us it will remove them. Cheryl Fiandaka, WBZ News.